So a really quick video on how to graph differential equations with your TI Inspire CAS CX. So nice. Graphing differentials. Okay, so first thing you want to do is go to your calculator and you're going to go to your actually from your home screen and choose graphs so it would look like this for me graphs then from here go to your go to your menu screen and you'll see this go to graph type choose differential equations and the differential that we're going to use today oh first off I I messed this up earlier when I was working on this make sure there's no initial condition down here in the bottom so we're going to use the differential equation. Um, let's do one half x. All right, and then just hit enter. So here's the slope field for that. So this is really interesting because if you were taking the AP Cal exam and it was a calculator section, you could actually do this. And the other thing that you can do is you can go back to this by hitting. Like if you want to set up an initial condition, then you can hit Control G, and then from Control G, let me move this out of the way. From Control G, you can go back to this first equation. Are you there? You got it. And then you can type in your initial condition, and your initial condi condition is that is some point. So I'm going to use the point. Um, 0, 2. So 0. You can tab over using this, using your right cursor, and then put in 2. And then you'll get a picture of the graph that satisfies that condition, and it would look like that. Okay? What we're not using right now is called the D solver, and it's a differential equation solver. And I'm going to do a video on that in just a uh, either today or tomorrow, but I wanted to make sure I got this one out for you because I think it will be really, really helpful for you. So looking forward to your comments. Please subscribe.